This is a video showing how to configure the time of flight accessory with the SmartGate. First, I'll click on my hardware setup. I'm going to attach this wirelessly, so I'll click on the Bluetooth. I'll click on the top link here for our AirLink. That is now paired. I'm going to select port 3 and click on this yellow circle. Once I've done that, I'm going to select the time of flight accessory. This will help me configure this correctly for the time of flight accessory. I'm now going to insert the time of flight accessory and you can see this line has changed from uh, to the green color here. I'll go ahead and close this drawer again. Next if we look on the timer setup just below it. So when I open up the timer setup drawer I'm uh, presented with uh, selecting a pre-configured timer. I'll click on next. Capstone sees that I have a smart gate which recognizes the two sides of the smart gate, as well as the time of flight accessory that I have configured the port 3 for. Next, I'll click on next. It already has the timing configuration for the time of flight with the smart gate. I'll click on next. It will report out the initial speed and the time of flight. If you wish, you can select other items as well. Click on next. The photo gate spacing is already set by the program as that is um, set by the dimensions within the product, and then it prenames this as Time of Flight Smart Gate. This field can be renamed if you wish. I'll click on Finish, close my drawer, and we can quickly create two displays here. Select Measurement, Initial Speed, Select Measurement, Time of Flight, and now you're ready to collect data.